Hi YouTubers, today we're doing a review on the T-Box Flytrap. So, I've had a bit of a gnat problem in my home hydroponic setup. And uh, these little gnats, they get around here and they buzz around. They can be a little annoying. And I wanted to get a some way to control them, but not to put anything inside the hydroponic solution or on the plants that would interfere with human consumption. So uh, I thought I would try these tea box fly traps. And uh, so for $13 and then when you add tax and um, uh, well, there's no shipping cost tax. It came out to around thirteen eighty-five. Uh, there are ten uh, strips in a uh, box, and it's really more of a um, sheet rather than a strip. And I'll show you that in a second. So anyway, I opened up a sheet and I cut the sheet in two halves, and one half of it I nailed up inside here and you can see this has been going on for about three weeks now you can see all the gnats that got stuck on there and if you look around at the plants uh, I do not see any gnats right now I mean everywhere looking around now there are some obviously otherwise they wouldn't be getting stuck on that strip but the vast majority of them get trapped on there. And so basically the problem has been controlled. Occasionally, I'll see one up on the upper deck. Because I don't have a strip up here yet. And I'm kind of debating as to whether or not to put an extra strip up top. Uh, although I'm not even sure it's necessary since that one piece down below seems to be controlling it well. My second unit, I took the other half of the one sheet and I uh, put it over here. And I don't think there are any bugs here because I haven't had anything on these grow shelves for the last week or so. I have the lights off right now. So, um,. I'll open one up and show you what it looks like. So this is what the thing looks like when you open it up. It's not quite flat yet. So basically, I opened the other one up fully, cut it in half, and nailed half up up there. And it looks... Let's get the measurements. So it measures nine and three quarter inches by seven inches. And as you can see, half of that sheet has been working great for the last few weeks up here. And at the rate it's going uh, on controlling the gnats from this plant uh, setup, uh, I suspect that will be good for, I don't know, maybe three months before I have to change it. So. That would give me six months on one sheet because I'm cutting it in half. In fact, you can see one gnat flying around there now and he just stuck himself on the sheet. It just trapped one. I don't know if you got were able to see that or not, but we just saw it trap a, a gnat. So for my setup, given... You know, I'm going to get six months out of a sheet. So for uh, ten sheets, uh, that'll, that will last me about five years. So maybe it uh, comes out to maybe a couple of dollars a year or so to control the gnats in my uh, indoor hydroponics setup. I'm in good shape. So I'm happy. <laughs> Thanks for watching. 